control! Shoot! Ted Banner's ball on the road, on location, in the tour bus of Pantera. That's right. So, how's it been going, guys? Good. And now you're on the road with Skid Row, which is not the type of bands that you usually play with, right? No, but taken hand in hand. Metallica went out with Ozzy before they were really big. Suicidal just went out with Queensryche. We kind of figured that this is the same type of thing. You know what I'm saying? Pantera, Skid Row. Okay, now you've got a new record that's coming out in February called Vulgar Display of Power, and it's a heavy mother. Okay, now I heard the new record. Of course, I've heard the last one, and I've heard even the stuff earlier than that. It seems like every record gets heavier and heavier and heavier, as opposed to trying to get commercial to sell millions of records. You guys get heavier and meaner. Would you kind of agree? Yes. <laughs> is, there, is there any way, did you say, like, let's just make this one just... It's a logical progression for us. This is how we felt. Not saying that if we're all really happy for the next record, it's going to be written about flowers and peace and stuff like that. But uh, it just came out this way, and uh, it is an angry record, but there's an underlying message that we feel real positive about and hope to get across. I want everybody to read the lyrics real close. You know what I'm saying? So tell us about some of the lyrics. Like, what were some of the things that you wrote about on this album? Well, there's a lot of things, especially on MTV, about racism and things like that that's really... I feel from just a black standpoint and I have you know it's okay they have all the reason in the world to be angry and the rise black man rise and all that stuff but I, it's coming from a non-racist white point of view and uh, they're really strong lyrics and uh, considering the crowds we play to we get black kids Mexican kids white kids Japanese etc cetera, etc cetera. it's for everybody and that's what this uh, album is for. It's for everybody. Everybody can relate. <clears throat> right on. We'll be back hanging with the guys from Pantera. But right now, it's frantic fringe time. And here's a video from Scatterbrain with Big Fun. Very shortly. So stick around. Bangers Ball on location in North Carolina with a couple of the guys from Pantera. And I have to confess, I lost the ring of power. We'll get you a new one. Okay. So it's okay. No, no big curse or something. Well, just wait. <laughs> we'll see. Now, you recently played in Moscow, I think, like in front of half a million people or something like that. Unbelievable. How many people were there that you played? There's not an official, but there, it's roughly around 700,000. So more than half a million. I mean, what's that like, playing in front of that? I mean, that's... I've never seen a concert with that many people in my whole life. I don't think we thought twice. We just went out and just did what we do, and we were watching the videotapes back, and we're going, jeez. Heavy. Because I've seen Pantera play in, like, clubs that have, like, 500 to 1,000 people tons of times, and now you're playing in venues that have 9,000, 10,000. Do you notice much of a difference? Uh, yeah. Huge roar of sea of people, you know, but... Is there one that you like better, the clubs or the arena? Um, kind of both in a way. You know, clubs are more intimate. Um, got everybody's up closer and more stage diving and shit going on. And then, you know, the arena's got more people and it's like, you know, reaching more people. It feels real good. Okay, let's talk about the new album, which comes out February 25th? Something, Something like that, which I heard, and it's heavy, and I, I dig it. Now, do you plan on doing a video? Or do you know what the first single is going to be from the album? Mouth for War. And the uh, video's going to be heavy. Have you started working on it yet? Not yet, two weeks. We got the concept together, it's going to be different. And I'm sure that when it's done, you'll see it on Headbangers Ball. But right now, let's take a look at another video from these guys from the last album. Here is Cowboys from Hell from Pantera. <laughs> 